Right now. Now. All right, let's push the trot. Work, work. Trot on. Canter. And drop. We'll keep her at the trot for a little bit, Riley. And then we'll do a transition down to the walk. Low, stand, and reverse, okay? Catherine, we've been working the mare regularly in the round 10. We like to keep our pregnant mares condition, so we think it helps them in their foaling time. So this mare has been in regular work in the round 10. We stopped riding her because she's less than eight weeks from foaling now. She's due on March 18th. And this is today, January, what, 27th? So she's getting pretty close. She's a very forward, very willing worker. You can see that she has a nice, big, stretchy trot. And and walking. Walking. Good. All right, let's go this way. That's fine. Good girl. Good girl. Now let's push the walk. Show her how she can do a nice big walk. This mare has a nice overstep. She's got a big, stretchy, working walk. A little too much, Riley. Walking. There you go. It's really, you know, it's a little art to push that walk and not get the trot. <coughs> Now, set her up for a woe stand, and you go ahead and do it. Good girl, Minuet. Now, raise your whip in your left hand and ask for a reverse. Let's see if we can get her to reverse the sword. There you go, and push the walk. Practice pushing the walk, but not into the trough. Good. All right, Randy, that's probably enough. We'll send that to Catherine. <laughs> 